Hello guys, welcome to another World Tech video. Today we are going to be doing an app review that is on the Apple software and obviously the Apple market only. Uh, there is a version of it that is available for the Android. Unfortunately, it doesn't have the full future features as the Apple market has. Now, you may know this in a previous video on the Android market. We did a review, uh, a lot of talk about it, which was text-free. Um, recently text free allowed picture messaging so say if I didn't have a picture plan like I know AT&T you can actually take off picturing and all that stuff but say if this was the AT&T phone I didn't have picture message but I had text free I could still send a picture message to another phone it didn't even matter if they had text free or not they still could receive it now it'd be from another number but still the idea about the technology and the apps that are coming out nowadays for these phones are getting over the top amazing. Now, we won't worry about the Android market at the moment. We're actually going to focus on the Apple text free with voice. Now, I did some research to see when it was going to come out for the Android. Uh, rumor is just rumor. There's no idea talk of when it will or if it will. Hopefully it does before too long. Um, I at least searched online. I'm running uh, not an up-to-date version. Uh, of course, I'm not rooted anymore, so I may root the phone to be a 3.0. I believe I'm running 2.21, which is what my My Touch was running as a rooted phone. Originally, it was a 1.6. On the iPod, we're running a 4.3.5. Yeah, and it's uh, and it's gel broken with thread snow, uh, which if people would like, we'll do a video. It's very simple and easy how to do that. Anyways, with text free, you set up an account. Now, if I wanted to, I could log out, create a new account, get a new number. Now, if you're inactive, you don't use it for so long, it automatically will delete your account, and you have to redo everything. So automatically, you enter your zip code and it generates a phone number for you, which is right in that location. Uh, it's hard to see, but that's where it is. You can tell your friends your number, uh, enable, enable Facebook chat, your remaining minutes. Now, you get free minutes. You start off with 10 minutes. Uh, to get more minutes, all you gotta do is click on that. You can earn free minutes or you can buy minutes. Now, there's no reason to buy. I've checked out. If you click on earn minutes, and then you get a list of apps you just download and you don't even have to keep them see the trick is you download the apps you wait maybe a day to earn your, your minutes as soon as your minutes is rewarded to your account you then can uninstall the app and you still keep your minutes that's what I did actually I redid my uh, jailbreak and I kept my minutes and the beauty part is to say if I call let's say if I call from this phone to the iPod then it doesn't charge me minutes but to call from this to that it would cost me however many minutes I use so it's actually pretty nice um, and of course we'll show this yes this is the iPod I'm not using an iPhone so it will work with either iPhone or iPad or iPod uh, which is nice so we will call my number and we'll block out my number number but as you can see you can either answer or decline I will answer and hello, hello? Hi. hi how are you how are you great. great and then we'll end the call it'll bring up an advertisement it is a free thing so I mean understand that but it also lets you earn so many minutes just to download it but we're gonna go ahead and skip that and as you can see, I was charged no minutes whatsoever. So, go back. And then you see, click on that again. Still, no minutes change. Uh, it's pretty nice. Now, you can change your ringtones. You can change it. We'll just keep it that though. Uh, texting tone, you can change wallpaper, you can wallpaper and theme. Um, 
I really never looked into this. Let's preview underground. So underground would be like that, eh. We'll probably just keep the original. Yeah, we'll keep the original. But anyways, it's a nice little app. It's free to download. It's obviously a must-have, especially if you're using an iPod. It's a must-have app. Why not take the advantage of the app and make phone calls with it? Yeah, you'll have to, I mean, you don't need a headset for it. I would recommend getting one, though, because since the mic and the speaker are both at the bottom, it tends to echo. I did a live call uh, testing it out with my brother, and, I mean, it was good quality. It sounds just like a phone, but, I mean, obviously, since they're real close, it kind of feedback to one another. But with my headset, I've had no problem making phone calls. Qualities are great. Um, it's definitely something to have. Now, maybe if you had an iPhone, maybe you wouldn't need something like this. Um, honestly, I wouldn't need something like this, but I run a online radio show, so I tend to use that number as a text number to call in line. Uh, it's really good. It's handy to use. I'd recommend it. It's free to download. It's on the app market. Now, if you're running an Android system, you can actually still download it but you can't get the text or the uh, call feature so we'll just go to the market and as you can see it only has text free no voice but it is free you still could send picture messaging and text messaging so take advantage of it uh, that's it for today's show stay tuned for some more videos I again apologize if the camera is a tad shaky I forgot my tripod so as soon as I get it we will be back in business so Rate, comment, subscribe, thumbs up the video if you like, and help us get more people. Uh, as soon as we hit 300 subscribers, we're going to be doing a giveaway on either a laptop or a video camcorder. So stay tuned. Get plugged in.